So I know there are definitely two different sides to this topic, but no matter what your side is, please just listen to this and keep an open mind. My hair blows up when I'm alone. I've done a few videos like this that are kind of like advice or like just talking about a subject, like an important subject, not about makeup or like fashion. So today I'm going to be talking about all the things that have been happening. I know you've probably heard so many things in school about the shootings that have been going on, but especially you probably have heard about the shooting in Broward County, which is like in Fort Lauderdale, Hollywood Beach area of Florida. And if you guys don't know, I live in Florida and that's about two hours away from me. Basically, I just kind of want to talk about gun control, to be honest, because, and what's been happening, because so many crappy things have been happening since that shooting. So that shooting occurred and I heard about it when I was done with swimming and of course I was disgusted and sad, but it didn't really like hit me until the next day at school when all my teachers they were talking to me and asking all the students if we are okay, if we want to talk about anything, if we have any questions, and then also on the announcements, they said let's take a moment of silence for the ones in Broward County. When we were talking about it, like they were saying, if there was a school shooting, where do we go if we're not in our classroom? They were just talking about that and it really hit me and I literally felt like crying. Ever since that shooting, more horrible things and closer things have been happening and it's just someone in a city nearby me like 30 minutes away some kid was threatening to bring a knife to school and he had like a kill list and stuff in his backpack and he got arrested i don't know all the details about that one i don't know if he brought a knife to school or if he was just like people heard he was going to it was just really scary because I, I go to that city all the time. I know that school. Yesterday, I found out that a girl, she was arrested and she was a girl that went to my elementary school with me. My sister was best friends with her. She was only 16 years old. She got arrested for posting photos on her Snapchat and her Instagram accounts. If you guys even talk about school shootings or gun regulation, I'll show you what a real school shooting is. And she was holding a rifle in her hand. And she also posted on her something on her spam and she said something about like shooting and then said, yes, this is a threat. And that one just really hit me because I knew that girl. And then that same day I found out a kid in my former middle school got kicked out of school because he was like, screaming and threatening to kill people at school and like, bring a gun. Some of my friends, they, their little siblings went home and they were like crying because they were sent home because some kid was like threatening to kill them or their classmates or whoever. It's getting closer and closer and closer to me, all these issues. And it's just scary. Like you just never know, which is really scary to think about. I don't want to think like that, but like, you just really never know these days, especially like in Florida, I don't know. Like, I don't know why, I'm sure there's things going on in other states too, but it just feels so close to me. Like, it feels like really real. And we've also been talking in school about it a lot too, like people are getting raged up about this because obviously a lot of people are saying guns need to be controlled, 18 year olds shouldn't be able to buy assault weapons, and then there were also people saying, you can't take away my rights of having a gun, which I just don't even understand at this point. Like, from this video, you can probably tell I'm not in favor of guns. I don't like them. I think I'm scared of them. I don't think they will protect you. Guns are made to shoot, and shooting kills people, kills animals. And I know not everyone who has a gun has that intention to kill people, but I'm saying a gun is a weapon that can kill people and hurt people so the fact that people like the majority of my classmates are still saying that i'm not okay with you taking away the right of me owning a gun and banning guns won't even do anything is ridiculous to me like how would you even have the guts to say that when 
children died. So now in Broward County, the police officers are like the patrols on school, the police officers that you have on your school, they're gonna have big machine military guns, which is scary to me because I'm scared of guns. Today we had a fire drill and my teacher informed us that it was a fire drill, which was nice, but in my head, I was just traumatized from the thing that happened two hours away from me that it could be the same thing. Someone could have whipped out a gun and started shooting. And on the news, they were sharing a story about a school and they thought it was like so awesome, which it is, that they had like, if there was a threat, smoke would come out of the ceiling so like he couldn't see. The police have cameras that they can look up on like real time. The classes they had a button if they needed like if there was like a threat which was awesome that they had all those things but like do we really have to live our lives in fear just to have guns in our country? Like is that really worth it to have a school which is where you're supposed to feel safe and where you should go to learn full of weapons, full of police officers, full of buttons in case an intruder comes in. I just don't understand why we would have, why we should have to live like that to go to school and get our education, which is such a simple thing, when it could be so much simpler just to eliminate them or make you have to wait till you're at least 21 or 25 to buy a gun. I've been seeing some things go around that are kind of like little jokes on like Instagram. I'm 18 and I can buy an assault rifle but I can't even drink or I can't even buy alcohol. Like that just, it really shows you like how stupid that law is. Like you're 18, you're just getting into college, you're just moving out, you're just becoming an adult and there you can already throw a gun in your hand. Like that just doesn't seem right. Some people are saying if we ban guns, only the bad people are going to have them, or how would I protect myself? But if we ban guns and no one has one, there won't be a need for them. I'm not completely against handguns. I think, like, I personally would never buy one. I would never own one. I would never want one in my house. But if people feel that they need to have one in order to protect themselves or just in case, then you do you, but I'm not going to do that. But I think I'm gonna wrap up this video. I probably missed out on a bunch of things I talked about, but I have like 20 minutes of footage that I need to edit down and my battery's flashing. So if you like these types of videos, please give it a thumbs up or comment down below. And feel free to also comment your opinions on this. I'd love to know, even if it's not what I agree about, but hopefully we can peacefully discuss how we feel about this topic even if you agree with me or you don't. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Sorry if you don't agree with me, but please just move on with your day and don't be rude. I hope nothing else happens for a long, long time. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.